In another cross-border escalation between Israel and Lebanon, six Hezbollah fighters have been killed in border clashes with Israeli forces, while one has been killed on the Israeli side. Hezbollah chief Nas Hassan Nasrallah sent out the strongest warning to Israel. The warning came after multiple drone strikes were reported in Israel. Hezbollah claimed responsibility for the attack immediately after Israeli jets pounded Hezbollah strongholds in Lebanon. Hezbollah claimed launching attack drones at two military sites near Akre in northern Israel. The Lebanon-based group warned that the much-anticipated response for killing Hamas chief is yet to come. As per the Israeli army, a number of hostile drones were identified crossing from Lebanon and one was intercepted. The army also said that several civilians were injured in the south of the coastal city of Naharia. Residents of the northern towns near Lebanon's border were told to stay near bomb shelters. Israeli medical officials said seven people were evacuated to hospital to the south of the coastal city of Naharia, one in critical condition. The IDF also said that 20 rockets were launched towards Golan region and rocket sirens were heard across Israel's northern area. Now, across the border in Beirut, Israeli warplanes broke the sound barrier and they did it three times over Lebanon's capital in less than 30 minutes on Tuesday before Hezbollah chief Sayyid Hassan Nasrallah was set to begin an address. Loud booms sent people in the city running for cover. Israeli warplanes flew low over the Lebanese capital with witnesses saying that they could in fact see the planes with their naked eye. The booms were the loudest heard in Beirut in years. Meanwhile, Hezbollah chief Hassan Nasrallah delivered a eulogy a week after the killing of Hezbollah military commander Fuad Shokar. Nasrallah claimed that Israel is right to be afraid of an attack from Iran and its axis of resistance against Israel and the West. The week-long wait for Israel is part of the punishment, part of the response and part of the battle. Because the battle is a psychological and moral one that requires nerves.